Hello everyone, welcome to another video of Gaming News. Today we're going to go over some four gaming news that might be interesting to you. Before we get started, please be sure to be subscribed to the channel to see more videos like this, and I hope you guys enjoy. But otherwise, let's get to the first gaming news. So first, we're going to start off with Fortnite's new collaboration with Balenciaga, which is kind of weird in some way, especially with the looks of the skins, with a dog wearing a hoodie that has been with Balenciaga on the shirt, and obviously you could see like the pickaxe shoe and even more so yeah there's a collaboration between a well-known clothing brand and obviously fortnite going to the next game we use we have ikea now having uh, the worldwide um, launch of their gaming section of ikea so for most of you who don't know i believe asus was the first to work with ikea to make furniture and I think they're going to partner up with like Logitech, maybe Razer in the future. So IKEA is basically going to be quite a favorite, a favorite among other retailers that's well, yeah, retailers that sell furniture because of the gaming side. But that's basically I can say for IKEA. I mean, it's going to be interesting, and with it being worldwide, it will be quite cool to get a nice gaming desk and maybe have a full game setup. Another gaming news is TikTok which I don't know why it's part of the gaming section, but TikTok now has a time limit for kids under the age of 14 in China. So for most of you that don't know, China has a huge restriction now due to articles saying that gaming is bad. And obviously now it's being affected towards other platforms like TikTok. So now not only do kids in China have a restriction of the times they can play games, but now they have a restriction of the times they can watch TikToks. So that's quite interesting, and I'm not sure how it will work in China. And for our final game news, CS, uh, CSC is now investigating Activision Blizzard, and I don't want to get into full detail, but if you know the, what's happening with Activision and Blizzard, you know why it's getting worse and worse for them. And with the new Call of Duty Vanguard coming out very soon, it's going to be interesting to see how much games will be affected with the brand. Otherwise, that's all for today's game news. I know it was very short, but that's all for this week. Come back next week for a different video. I might not do game news next week because I'm going to be on holiday, but it will be a pre-scheduled video for next week. Otherwise, hope you all enjoy it. Please be sure to be subscribed to the channel. Be sure to like, comment down below, and yeah, if you want to see more videos like this, go check this video out. You can go even check this video out. And click this button right here to subscribe to the channel right now. Otherwise, hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys next week or next video. But hope you all have a good day, and see you guys next one. Bye.